Todoist is one of the best and simplest task management apps on the market. However, without a little organization, it can easily become overwhelming, especially as you start to add a lot to it. So today, I want to walk you through some of my top tips for staying organized without becoming overwhelmed on Todoist. Here we go. First, prime your to-do list the night before, so when you come in tomorrow, everything is roughly set up the way you want it. And this is sort of an example of there's no overdue tasks, and everything is in kind of a rough priority for what I want to get done today. Next, always try to live out of the today view when you're trying to get things done. You don't need to worry about what's due tomorrow or next week. All we want to think about today is, what are my tasks that I want to get done today? Then, when creating new tasks, I always suggest starting them with a verb. That just helps you understand, what do I need to start to accomplish this task? So if you see all of the tasks on this list, roughly, did I do my job right? Yep, start with a verb. Schedule this, update that, review this. Next, and here's a power tip. Only try to focus your mind's eye on the two to three tasks that you can accomplish right now. So to do that, I've created a label. I call mine do now, but you can call yours whatever you want. I already have a couple of tasks down here that have the label do now, but to add it to another task, just click into labels, click do now. And then I have a save search in my sidebar for that label. So I can focus my mind's eye on just those two to three tasks that I can get accomplished right now. Finally. Practice the concept of eat the frog. This is from a quote that's attributed to Mark Twain. But essentially the concept is do the hardest thing on your to-do list first. You might be staring down a to-do list of nine or 10 tasks for the day, but you don't know how to get started on any of them because there's one that's dragging you down. Try to get that one done first and then everything else should flow after that. So those are my top tips for tackling your day with Todoist. If this video has been helpful to you, please hit the like button, subscribe, or share this video on your socials. That will tell me you like what I'm doing and you want to see more tips from me in the future. Thanks so much. Take care.